Historic places are under threat, in serious disrepair or disappearing. The Committee Permanent sur l'Environnement et le Développement Durable croit fermement que le gouvernement fédéral doit agir pour protéger nos lieux historiques et patrimoniaux. Canada's historic places are a source of pride for Canadians. They're part of our collective history and a legacy that we pass on from generation to generation. Canada needs legislation to preserve this legacy and protect historic places and archaeological resources. The government must take a leadership role to safeguard the heritage character of its own designated buildings if it wants to be recognized as a credible voice in this issue. And this obligation should be entrenched in legislation. The government federal must support the efforts of Canadians to protect the historic places that do not belong to them. For example, like the Le Maison Bryson here in Mansfield, Quebec. Il faut que le gouvernement fédéral fixe l'investissement annuel dans le programme national pour les lieux patrimoniaux à 10 millions de dollars par année au minimum. Efforts can be strengthened to preserve privately owned historic places by expanding the range of available financial tools. For instance, introducing a tax credit for owners of heritage buildings would attract private investment to preserve and restore historic sites. I'm here at the Napanee Town Hall, a national historic site. Preserving historic sites is a key economic development tool for rural sustainability and rebuilding Main Street and the rural small towns across Canada. But small communities often lack the resources to do it themselves. The government must review the national cost-sharing program for heritage places to ensure rural Canada is receiving its fair share of funding. Indigenous peoples must play a greater role in protecting their heritage. Current tools must be adapted in order to protect Indigenous heritage places. And we support the Truth and Reconciliation Commission's calls to action concerning Indigenous heritage. As we conclude the year of Canada 150 celebrations, it's our hope that future generations have the opportunity to appreciate Canada's past through its legacy of its historic places. Now is the time to create protective legislation and financial programs to support our heritage.